hi guys welcome back to my channel um today i'm coming at you guys with a hair installation video just showing you guys how you can quickly do a five minutes installation and get out the house um this is what it looks like it's pasted pasted it's glued well it's pasted but you get what i'm trying to say um so quickly get out the house when you're in a rush to get to school in a rush to get to work in a rush to go meet up with friends and you're late and you quickly just want to look cute and paste your hair um obviously you can throw in some shades nyana if you don't have enough time to do your makeup and just look cute and get them um this hair is from eula hair it's a 24 inch curly wig um this is not the curl pattern you guys will see the original curl pattern in the video i combed it out and that's why it looks so fluffy and so full and so rich um i completely completely am in love um please don't forget to like comment and subscribe i hope you guys enjoy this video and one more thing thank you guys so 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 much for voting for me on the dash kitchen tv um competition the seafood boil story time the previous one thank you guys so so much um i really really appreciate you guys' support i love you guys to the moon and back i really appreciate you guys please do like comment and subscribe i love you guys so so much you guys always support me and you guys always come through for me and i really really appreciate that about you guys um please enjoy the hair installation i know i look crusty but remember this will quickly get out the house type of thing please Okay, yeah, so the hair comes in like this cute bag and it has their branding in gold and everything. It's very cute and I actually when I received the package I was like, where's the hair? Because I'm used to hair coming in boxes and stuff. So when you open it, it's obviously the unit, the hair. Um, I'll get into that just now. Um, inside, you get two wig caps but they are in black um what is this oh a pretty card a cute little card from them telling you thank you for choosing them um please kindly check the parcel if it has any problems we will try our best to help you hope you can be satisfied with our services this is actually so cute um then at the back they have a refund policy so they basically care they care that it, how the hair came and how you received the hair and then here they give you a little instruction pamphlet where it tells you how to take care of the hair their recommendation for shampoos what kind of shampoos they recommend i'm so sorry for the bright light and all of that this is really cute and then what else is in here lashes and they are very dramatic you guys know me and drama in my eyes on my eyes by my eyes eye drama so these are probably gonna come in handy soon okay let's look at the hair it's a curly wig um it's 24 inches um just Twenty-four inches of curls, honey, come through. It's just twenty-four inches of curly beauty. Um, yeah, it's the length is twenty-four inches. It doesn't have a smell. It definitely does not have a funny smell at all. Okay, um, I'm trying to think how I'm gonna style this hair it is 360 degrees net the net the lace is 360 degrees then it has these for adjustment at the back and then it has three combs inside four four combs inside so yeah um it is pre-plucked it looks pre-plucked can't even put on my hand to show you guys because it's gonna fall but it's definitely pre-plucked okay let me see it It 
it goes all the way to my boob it doesn't pass my boob so i don't know about the length but i think because it's really curly and it's tight curled it's really tight curls maybe that's why it's not that long um okay so let me install this hair i'll take you guys through the process but yeah let's see how it looks let's see how the end product looks i'm excited because i think these are really cute curls so first things first is i'm gonna put foundation on the lace my foundation so that when i put the hair on it looks like it's my hair it's coming out of my skin um i'm gonna use my maybelline new york uh super stay and i'm just going to put it on the lace with a brush my foundation brush okay so this is what it basically looks like from the outside so now i'm just gonna cut off the lace this excess lace i don't know if i should cut it after gluing it on my hair or if i should just cut it and go along with the hairline that they gave me and then just try and fix it later if it's too much okay let me let me do that i'm gonna cut it off now and then put it on my head and then glue it with the hairline they gave me if i don't like it then i'll fix it before i glue it on to brush my hair I actually don't even have a mirror in front of me so I'm winging this life thing right now it's actually too long by my ear I need to cut it So I use the got to be glue spray. You can also use the tube gel glue thingy, but I think this one is just so quick and efficient and it gets the job done really quick. Um, I saw on a previous hair video, somebody had asked me where they can get this. I'm sorry, I thought like everyone knew um, from Clicks. I get it from Clicks. I haven't seen it at Discam, but I definitely got mine at Clicks. It was a hundred and 120 140 i think it was 120 i don't know i think it was 120 um it's a blasting free spray i bought this last year sometime but it was a long time ago and it still has some things inside i have another one that i haven't touched because i thought i was going to run out but this lasted me for over eight months now and Okay, I, I wear wigs often, but not that often. Like, I don't wear them every day for a whole year. I wear them probably for 8 out of 12 months in a year. I'm rambling now. Let's just get to pasting my hair. So, I'm going to start here. I'm going to start glue it here first. Then, once it's stuck here, and then I'm going to start gluing it on my sides. So, what you do is you spray where you want to paste it, and then... You wait for that to get tacky before you actually spray it down you can use a hair dryer my hair dryer is really far <sighs> my hair dryer is really far i don't want to fetch it so i'll just use what i did before i got a hair dryer This does the job of a hair dryer basically this dries right i'm fanning i'm actually looking for a mirror as though i brought one i know i don't have a mirror here but i'm looking for a mirror wow 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 Relax. 
Okay, so if you have a dryer and you want it to be like perfect, perfect, then now you like press it down with a comb while drying over it. You understand? That's gonna give you like the perfect melt. Like the melt. Oh my gosh, what is your problem? Yeah. So this is a quick get out the house. Hair installation. So now we're gonna go do the sides. So you can start with whichever side, I'm right-handed, so I always start with my right hand. My right side, sorry, not my right hand. So, I think what you do is you should, like, measure where, like, see how you have it on now? You put it there and you see where to put the glue. So what I've noticed, because I have a lot of wigs and they all sit differently, so I know, I think it's because I've owned them for so long, I know which wig sits where. So for a certain wig, I know, Woody, okay, I have to spray here. I don't even have to check anymore. For a certain wig, I have to spray here. But like, if... <sighs> oh God. I don't even know what I was saying. I lost my train of thought. But once you get used to a wig, Without even like putting it on your head, you'll know where to spray. So that will like give you an idea. I think I should go get a comb. So I was saying, as time goes by, your wig installations will be quicker because you're going to start skipping steps like having to measure, having to do this, having to do that because you already know your hair. So, a dryer would have actually been quicker than this. But I was late to get my hair dryer. I don't know if you guys can see that it looks like the hair is literally growing out of my scalp and that's what it's supposed to look like I don't know if you guys can see that Ouch! killed it so we measure where it sits guys and then we spray over there okay so to make sure everything is like flat flat i'm gonna take my tail comb comb tail whatever this part is and i'm gonna spray it a little bit with my glue and then go over the edges just to make sure that everyone is happy extra security so now we are going to put this to make sure everything is laid flat um, if I have makeup on it will look like it's coming out of my scalp Promise, I don't have foundation on and this is my natural skin that's why you guys can see like a line
okay so while that is laying right um let's take care of these curls baby i don't know if i want like i want to provoke it so i'm going to comb it out and see what it gives me this is not even tight enough i'm going to comb out these curls and see what how, how far i can manipulate them and then i'm obviously okay i'll show you the whole process okay hey now i think i like this i like this i don't know if i should do a oh i don't know if i should do a middle part or like a side part let's see first Or should I do a side for the drama mama? <laughs> Let's see how a side part looks. Uh. And then we're gonna do young baby hairs here. Yeah, how does that look? What do you guys think? I think middle. I think middle. This we can. Wow. This we can work with. I'm gonna spray this baby with water. Where is my water? And just spray it. This is an old spray bottle that I put water in. So I don't, I like this volume. I like this combing out volume. So I don't want to lose that. So I'm not going to use too much water. Am I making sense? Ooh, I like this. I really like this. Okay, so to flatten it here, I'm going to use mousse. Where my mousse at? I'm going to use mousse. I'm not going to use... So this mousse is curl control. I'm not going to use it on all the hair because I like this curl pattern that I made right now. So I don't want to mess it up. And I'm not going to use too much mousse as well. This should be enough. Because remember, it's just for the top. Do you see me, honey? Do you see me? Okay, I'm just gonna put foundation here to like make the line visible. I was saying I can't believe I did this whole installation without a mirror. <laughs> I'm risking everything right now. I think I'm gonna need a mirror for this. Wrong. Got it. Wrong, niggas. <laughs> wrong, wrong, wrong. Ooh, that's cute. That's no longer straight now. I don't know what direction this line is going. But we move. There we go, honey. 
okay good guys this is the final look of my installation i hope you guys Ooh, wait it's not this would look really cute hi what's up <laughs> guys this is the finished look of the hair um it was a quick quick um let me quickly get out the house look when you're quickly trying to install your hair and you're trying to get somewhere and you don't have time so i hope you guys enjoyed it please like comment and subscribe and this hair is from eula hair i'll put all the details down in the description box i will see you guys on the next video please like comment and subscribe and please continue to support me i appreciate you guys so so much thank you guys so much